don't know what to do. <laughs> Hey, it's Greg Baird from northernvoice.com and meefers.com. It is a beautiful Saturday in March right here in Chicago. And of course, I'm stuck in my kitchen once again because I'm hungry and I'm kind of in a chilly mood. But you know what? I'm taking this apron off and I'm going to head down to Sidetrack because they're doing the 11th annual Jack Daniels Chili Cook-Off from 2 until 6 today to benefit the Gay and Lesbian Chamber of Commerce, which I'm a happy member of. So I'm going to go down, shoot a little film, and the best part, of course, we're going to put the books away, but you are coming with me, and we're going to check out all this great chili. It's been going on for a while, many, many years they've been celebrating this annual event, and it's sure to be good. And we're going to be talking to some people and checking out just what makes the perfect pot of chili. Then I don't need to have all these cookbooks. So come along with me. I'm going to get this off, put my coat on, and we're going to head out. And it is a beautiful, sunny day out on a Saturday, and I can't wait. Just a really great time. Uh, it benefits us, benefits our organization, so really great cause, and we're happy that you're here. If you want to check out anything else that we do throughout the year, our website is www.glchamber.org. Thanks for coming. Hi, I'm Jake from Hamburger Mary's. We brought a chili today for everybody to try. This is our chocolate stout chili made with braised chuck steak, and then a chocolate uh, infused stout that we do right, right in our own uh, microbrewery right next to our spot. Got a little bit of pineapple grilled relish and some white corn sticks to go with it as well. It's delicious. Excellent. Is this your first time? No, no. Second time. Wow, so it's not your first time in the rodeo here. No, no second time. I'm still, still a rookie, but not a virgin. Excellent. So how long does it take for you to make this wonderful chili? It actually took me uh, three days, three different installments. Of wow. Braising the meat, cooking the beans, bringing it all together, and then finishing off all the garnishes. Excellent. Is this something special that you're doing for here, or do you do this at the restaurant as well? Uh, this is actually something special we do for here. Yeah, I can't really pull it off the restaurant every day. It's been three days in one pie chili. But it goes really well here. Uh, you definitely see it at the restaurant. It's special from time to time. Excellent. Well, good luck, Kate. Hi, I'm John Young from Kitchen on Roscoe. Uh, we've been involved with uh, this amazing event, uh, the Jack Daniels Chicago Chili Cook-Off, for the past 11 years. Um, so this is the 11th annual. Our first event was the first year, and we had just opened our restaurant. Uh, my wife and I own Kitchen on Roscoe in Roscoe Village. Um, I think part of the reason that we were invited to this event is that from the very beginning, we've had an amazing gay and lesbian clientele, uh, amazingly supportive. And we were also very fortunate that first year to win this competition. Uh, we've won it three times since, including last year, so this year we're back to defend our title. Um, we've got our uh, our wow chili, we call it. It's got uh, chorizo, uh, an apple with smoked bacon, uh, Angus beef, uh, we do uh, black bean in there, and then it's got four types of chilies, ancho, guajillo, chipotle, and habanero chilies. Um, some other amazing ingredients in there. Uh, some of the accoutrement that we bring along are uh, some homemade herb tortilla chips. Um, they've got a, uh, a barbecue rub uh, sprinkled on top of them, uh, kind of a uh, little house secret that I use for ribs. On this side, we've got an habanero cornbread. And then today, just seasonality-wise, we've got a nice creme fraiche that we've sort of prepared with some uh, roasted butternut squash. We also brought our uh, house signature mango mojito salsa. Um, so everything kind of has a little bit of a kick. And if it's not spicy enough, I've got an habanero lime mojo that we bring along for those people who are real dare takers. Um, 
once again, we, we love being here, and, and thanks for having us, and uh, thank you. And if we're looking for your fine restaurant? If you're looking for our fine restaurant, we're located in Roscoe Village. It's about a mile and a half west of Wrigley Field at okay. Damon and Roscoe, 2005, West Roscoe. It's called Kitchen on Roscoe, spelled like Kitchy, K-I-T-S-C-H, with an apostrophe N. Uh, our website is K-I-T-S-C-H-N.com, www, of course. Uh, and that's how you can find us on the web. Right. Good luck today. Thank you.